Let's go. Things had gone Shit. from fine to fucked up in about a second, and now there were two idiots at the wheel. Clear. You got the floor? Sure. Right. Look after yourself, bro. Stay safe. It wasn't my own safety I was concerned about, trophy wife or not. I'd said I would protect the girl. I hoped I hadn't lost my edge, along with everything else. It was time to choose, a nasty fall or a bullet to the head. was the boss lady, only this time she wasn't calling for more liquor in her cocktail. She was out on one of the balconies, and I hoped, not about to be thrown off it. Might have been stupidity, or drunkenness, or maybe both. But before I knew it, I was back taking insane risks, trying to save fallen women. Tranquila, tranquila. Nós cuidamos disso. Nice work. Hey, you need a hand? No, you. Who the hell's Rodrigo? Yeah, I don't know, man. Thanks. Somebody's gotta go find him. Está tudo sob controle agora. Fica tranquilo. I imagined the elevator doors opening to a firing squad of muzzles. As far as I could see it, the one thing my plan had going was that no one else would be stupid enough to pull this move. Where you got? I didn't want to fuck this up more than I already had. It looked like they were taking him out through the basement. Maybe I still had a shot. Rodrigo was too rich a prize for them to throw away. Sure, I'd have to work hard to get him back, but I knew the bad guys would want the boss alive almost as much as I did. The control 
box was on the wall to the left of the gate. being famous as well as rich is the bad guys know who to kidnap. Another parking lot rattling with gunfire. Was I too late? Você acha que é falando com meus homens assim? Você acha que tem o direito de matar as pessoas a sangue frio, Becker? Cala a boca, cuzão! Continua dando multas. Não ponha o nariz onde não é chamado. Vamos! Ah, me ajuda, cara. Chama uma ambulância! Vamos. Me ajuda. Eu vou Max. Você fez isso. Don't look so good. Hey, what could be better, huh? The good guys are reunited, and the Commando Sombra are dead. I guess. So who's this guy? I don't know. Some kind of cop. Different branch of the police. Not Ufe, but uh, normal cops. I don't know about this stuff. Politics. Everywhere politics. Shit, Max, you look kind of beat up. Let's get this lot home, and then I'll, I'll get you home too. Come on. Time for some R and R. The only way I knew how. I was ready for bed. <laughs> A couple of days later, it was back to work. Ferrying the boss's broad and his dipshit of a brother out for the night so they could recover from their brush with mortality. Then again, what did I expect? These were the kind of people who went to nightclubs in helicopters. Fabiana had brought her sister along, presumably so she could show off just how rich and empty her life was. And boy, was she about to learn the meaning of rich and empty. Max! Max! I was speaking to you! Sorry, what was that? Oh, I was saying we get into a lot of scrapes, man. 
Well, we're still here. Hey. Thanks to you, Max. I owe you my life. Boom. It wasn't just him, huh, baby? Oh, yes, Marcel. I'm sure you did a lot to save everyone. You were probably worried about getting blood on your stash. <laughs> Very funny. <laughs> Thank you, Max. I don't know what I would do without my sister. Mmm, spend even more time doing something useful. <laughs> you know she works in the favela. She's the good sister. Oh, shut up. <laughs> what did you hear, Faba? More bodies turned up, more people went missing. But it's horrifying. Can someone say Buzz Q? Hey. I'm just kidding. <laughs> it is a cool town, man. <laughs> hey, here we are. <laughs> I love this place. I love this view. It's a real chill place to hang, you know? Do a little business, have some fun. I need it too. I've been working far too hard. Like a whore during Fleetchy Weeky, as my roommate used to say. <laughs> you like that, Max? That's pretty funny. Fashion week. My God, Egypt, but so beautiful. You know Anastasia? Oh yeah, I know Anna. <laughs>